Good morning, good morning guys and welcome back to yet another video. Thank you so much for watching. You are a dear, you are a star. If it is your first time here and you'd like to see more of me, please subscribe, do it right now so you don't forget to like this video if you enjoy it and refer it to your friends and friends and friends. By the way, my name is Toba, but you can call me wife of the year. Today, it is a Saturday morning and I've showered, I ended another vlog. I'm starting a new one because I'm trying to be consistent because I am that girl. If you didn't know, you are subscribed to a consistent queen. <laughs> yeah, we need to go and do our groceries, just buy things, a few things that we don't have that we need to top up and see where the rest of this day actually takes us. I don't have any other plans except for just going and getting groceries because it, yeah, it was a long week i'm not trying to do too much so yeah i do want to go to church tomorrow and i hope the devil doesn't win oh my god i hope the, de the devil doesn't win because what but anyway let us start this vlog i hope you'll enjoy it and that i'll be able to convince you to subscribe for more similar content let me go and find something to wear and then we can head out i don't want to wear anything that would require me to iron it <laughs> I think I could get away with wearing this dress. I don't know. I think I can get away with wearing this dress. You always said we were the good ones. Like an 18 minute thriller movie mm -hmm. I always knew you always meant it But now we're standing on the best side too Stress if I knew it was gonna rain, it is raining outside, cats and dogs and all. Ah! 
Yo, it is so dark. I'm sorry. I apologize. I'm doing this for the people that like hauls because I also enjoy watching hauls and just seeing what other people buy, you know, like I, that is so interesting to me. It's just doing their hauls. There is a lot of work, but I'm going to do it for you guys. Anyway, we went to Macro, we went to Woolworths, we went to Checkers, we went to Food Lovers, we went to Pick and Pay. We went to Gorimas and we went to Amapele Pele. So many, seven shops actually. And please don't come for me and tell me Woolies is cheap because it's not. It's not. It is not. There are things at Woolies that are cheap and there are things at Woolies that are not cheap. And I am not going to buy things that are not cheap at Woolies when I can get them somewhere else. Now that that is out of the way, I hope you won't be coming for me anymore because calm down. It's not that deep. <laughs> Anyway, we bought some Handy Andy. I got five of these because I am a stockpile queen. Oh, we got five of these and I'm really happy because I am growing my stockpile. I'm just going to push them aside. We got three of these Motain Multi Insect Killer. We got three of these because ants flies mosquitoes it's a lot i got one of the sunlight liquid refill because we still have i just wanted to add on top of what we have we got the star soft fabric softener i don't use this on clothes i use this on the floor when i am mopping it just gives a very nice fresh smell when you mop the floor so i just just a tiny bit on in the water when I am mopping and I feel like it makes a lot of difference. Everything just looks cute. Not not looks cute. It, it smells amazing. So this is what I use. I've got three domestos. I think there's a household that survives without this. I always buy the purple one. I don't know why. We got two Nivea for men lotions for my husband. We bought three Colgate toothpaste. The white one, plain white one, is my fave. We got three Sunlight Green Bar Cubes because I like it. And because this is the only thing that I use on my body when I'm taking a shower or bathing in general. This is the only thing that works for me at the moment. So, actually not at the moment i've been using this since i was a child and i still use it now so i'm not trying to fix something that is not broken so yeah and then we got granola we always buy the one kg we got oats instant oats because who's trying to cook oats all bran flakes two of these whole wheat pastas when i say pastas it's like i'm saying pastas as in the preachers pastas uh kellogg's noodles one kg curry powder the supreme if you don't want to buy all the other curry powders that i buy because i buy a lot let me show you actually oh curry powder me oh curry powder me I buy a lot of curry powders, but I buy these like once or twice a year, so it doesn't matter. But if you don't want to buy all the other ones, just buy the Supreme. It is good. It smells good. Tastes good. And then I got myself the garam masala. This is a steak and chops spice. Uh, wet pickle masala. Kashmiri masala, biryani powder, a dania and jeera both in here. They are mixed. So these are the curry powders that I use. I mix them and it creates magic. So 
Yeah, I also bought one parboiled rice from Woolies. We use brown rice, but I feel like when I'm cooking, uh, like biryani or if I'm cooking curry and rice, I don't like the brown rice. So I always have this just in case I make any of those meals. I bought two bags of apples. I don't, I'm actually running out of space. We got green peppers, red onions, and red peppers. Also got baking paper because I'm not trying to wash the oven tray. That is the most boring thing to do. Got some beans and air fryer parchment paper because also I'm not trying to be washing the air fryer. <laughs> We got three of the lays, I think they were on the promo at Checkers, so we got three of these. And then we also got some Viennas, pork chops always, it's a staple in this house. It is a staple. We got some beef, uh, cheese, <laughs> cheese, we got cheese. And do you know why I'm being awkward right now? Because my husband is stealing rice in front of me why is it what is this what are we doing and then i got some uh pork ribs oh is it gonna fall i got two bags of blueberries frozen for my smoothies and then i got a tray of chicken and mint i also got ice cream and we all know why we have ice cream in this hall because someone <laughs> we got ice cream because my husband likes it i got two of these i'm not sure where the other one is cucumber butternut i think it's making noise sriracha sauce is it sriracha yeah there's this girl on tiktok ash i think she's a colored the one who always says what does she say it is freaking delicious <laughs> she always uses sriracha and these sauces so i was inspired and i got this superior soy sauce soya sauce yeah sriracha in this and then we got two six pack six packs of red bull we got three of these mini traders these are so nice. Why are these so nice? Oh my god, they're so nice. And then we got two plain yogurts. We also got six pack milk. Two Wellington tomato sauces. One kg white sugar. Oh, I don't have space. I don't have space and I don't want to drop things. We got two boxes of, um, what is the citrus? Nachi, I think. Yeah, two of these. And then we got the combo. We got carrots, onions, beetroot, and potatoes. I think that is all. We didn't buy bacon this month. We didn't buy uh, Russians. We didn't buy vors because we still have it. So I was like, if we buy, we won't have space to put it. So yeah. I think that is all i'll see you guys i don't know when tomorrow i think or later i'm not sure but bye for now the way i abuse this what is this a fabric and a spritz <laughs> i'm always like and it's still here months later and it's not finishing today it is a sunday morning and we don't have any plans that are gonna require us to leave the house i want to do a few things and i want to take you guys along because i'm tired of not taking you guys along and coming and like actually coming here and saying i'm going to cook and not taking you guys along i'm going to do this and not taking you guys along so i want to take you guys along on everything that i do today yesterday i did my nails I was actually waiting for my husband. 
I was actually keeping him company when he was busy. We went to bed after 2 a.m. And I'm so tired and sleepy right now. Like, I'm so tired and sleepy, but I need to do things. I need to go and brush my teeth now, wash my face. And I think I did an amazing job. Like, I feel like I'm getting better and better. The shaping and whatever is not the greatest but yeah i also didn't have uh like my filers are not breaking anymore like they smooth i need to buy new filers for my next set but i'm obsessed with the fact that i can do my own nails and they last a long time so yeah it's just that i'm also obsessed with trying to fix them and doing them before they can reach it's full like the last day so yesterday i had no business filing down what i had and then putting this on it's it's more or less the same color i mixed this color it's white and pink i didn't want like a pink in your face kind of color i wanted like yeah this is cute i think this is very nice i am proud of myself let me go and brush my teeth and wash my face and just get this day started Loves and cries you cooking i took out some chops i am going to make them with what do i want to make them with um i think i want to make them with um do i want to tie it in the front or in the back i don't know i'm gonna make it this is my apron i'm gonna make it with i'm thinking of making a potato bake Oh, I'm so lazy to cook today. All I want to do is sleep. Like, I just want to sleep. I just want to sleep. But I want to cook so that tomorrow I don't have to. So I need to do what I need to do. Let's start cooking. Hey, you couldn't see it coming. You might have thought it, but you couldn't change it Hey, it's not right or wrong It's about trying, find the sin
hours from dawn as I'm driving at night Waiting to get somewhere What can go wrong when we say it out right? I really wish you were here People seem to know just where they're heading While you and I just feel like we're pretending I can't do it on my own When I'm this far away from home Won't you tell me something good Won't you tell me something good As I think of you and I There's too much gonna pass us by If we don't talk like we should Won't you tell me something good Weekend is gone and we're lying in bed Waiting to start the day To know just where they're heading While you and I just feel like we're pretending I can't do it on my own When I'm this far away from home Won't you tell me something good Won't you tell me something good As I think of you and I There's too much gonna pass us by done cooking but now for my most or my favorite part of the day i'm about to rest and that's on japan let me go and rest i'll pick up this phone to record tomorrow or i don't know i don't think i'm going to the office tomorrow because people are sick and i'm not trying to get sick everyone has flu and i'm not like i'm genuinely not trying to get flu so i'm not going to the office tomorrow because they all passed it on to one another and now even their families have it and i'm just like no 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 <laughs> my uh my colleague uh texted me to say that they're all sick and i was like thanks for the heads up i appreciate it so i'm not gonna go in tomorrow but now we are going to chill and watch something and just have a wholesome Sunday. This is the situation. I am in bed, but I'm also realizing that I feel like I don't want to buy bread anymore. Like I can just bake it. And the more I bake it, the more I can perfect it because practice makes perfect. So yeah. But now I'm tired. My feet are killing me. But I think it would be a good idea if I baked it. The problem with me baking is that when I bake my loaves, I just add ingredients. Like I don't I don't have a recipe like that I can share. I don't I don't even know how many of what do I put in. I usually just wing it. And yeah, because yeah, I do have flour. I have, I like using the self-raising flour, but I don't have it today. So I could possibly just use the normal flour with baking powder. And I don't know. I have baking powder. I have eggs. I have everything that I can possibly need to make this loaf so that we can use it throughout the week. And then I'll just keep baking them every Sunday or whenever I get a chance. Yeah. I can't do it on my own. When I'm this far away from home, won't you tell me something good? Won't you tell me something good? As I think of you and I, there's too much gonna pass us by if we don't talk like we should. Won't you tell me something good? I can't do it on my own. When I'm this far away from home, won't you tell me something good? Tell me something good Won't you tell me something
I don't know if I should laugh, if I should cry. Do you guys remember that like a few weeks ago, I came on here and I was like very appreciative and I was like, thank you so much for your support and for watching the ads. And then I saw like I was going to use the money that I got from YouTube in that month to uh, spoil our mothers, get them gifts and take them out and I was not going to use a cent from my own money. Do you guys remember that? Do you remember how excited I was and how happy I was and how appreciative I was of your support? Immediately when I said it, you, you stopped. And this is not the first time. Whenever I come here and I'm appreciative, I feel like I don't know if people's hearts are dirty or if if like i don't know if people don't like to see other people succeed or what but when i said that three weeks ago y'all decided no what ads we're not gonna watch ads we're not gonna comment anymore we're not gonna not, not everyone but i'm saying it shows like it, the numbers don't lie and i feel like this is the second time this happens where i come here and i'm very happy i'm like oh my god thank you guys so much for sharing my videos on your instagram and instagram stories and for doing this and for doing that and then immediately when i say that after posting or publishing that video you guys just decide Uri, why are you happy why are you growing why are you succeeding and it's like you guys are like not under our watch <laughs> obviously not everyone but it's like someone is like some people are basically saying not under our watch what we watching ads and that is paying you not under our watch. that is not gonna happen while we're still alive we're not gonna do that and i'm just like is it a sin to come here and say i am like i appreciate you guys because this doesn't even happen like this is why i'm always very reserved of i always reserve uh talking about my life because I feel like if I talk about my life and I say how happy I am, how blessed I am and how everything in my life is like, I, I feel like mm -mm. <laughs> maybe you should just pretend to be miserable so that people are happy. I don't know how this works. It's like mind blowing to me that when I tell you guys that I appreciate you, the, ne the very next week and the weeks after you're just like, no, 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 no. Why are you so happy? Eesh, my arm is sore now. Why are you so happy? What is this? You can't, you, you don't deserve to be happy. You don't deserve good things. And I'm just like, oh my God. I don't know. <laughs> it's just a weird thing that I've picked up. And I'm just like, maybe I'm crazy. Maybe I'm overthinking things. I don't know. But I just feel like whenever I'm appreciative of the support that I receive from you guys, it stops. And then I don't talk about it for a while. And then I just cruise this life thing. And then I see the support again. So I don't know. Guys, please tell me what is this? What is going on? Do people have power to do that? To just be, I don't know. Or is it like a coincidence that whenever I say thank you, you people just, I don't know. I'm so like, <sighs> I honestly don't know but anyway today it is a monday and this is like a weekend vlog what you guys are watching now so i'm gonna end it now because if i carry on vlogging for the rest of the week i'm not gonna have enough space because i feel like when i go and do groceries and i do a haul it takes up a lot of space on my phone and if you didn't know i would record with my phone and it is a 64 gig i think and i have a lot of other apps that i need and videos take a lot of of a lot of space and then when i have like when i don't have space then i'm unable to export the video the video from the editing app that i use which is in short so it that it then becomes a thing of and i have to delete almost everything and i have to restart my phone and it just becomes too much so that is why i need to end off the vlog here i am sorry that it was i didn't do a lot like it was a, a weekend vlog but i'm gonna start vlogging again today for the rest of the week for next week's vlog thank you so much for watching and making it this far i will see you guys in my next video good bye